8 News Now reporter Madison Kimbrough spoke with parents and kids at that park today. She joins us live from the newsroom with the very latest. Madison. Yes, this was an act of arson as the Reunion Trails Park playground was set on fire New Year's Eve, leaving at least $100,000 in damage. Some kids uh, like really enjoy this this part of the park, and some kids maybe not as much. But for all the other kids that actually do enjoy it, it's really discouraging for all of them to see that their favorite their favorite part about the playground is now destroyed. <laughs> A favorite hangout spot for several kids and their parents. Part of the Reunion Trails Park playground was set on fire New Year's Eve night. After security footage shows three people walking on the premises with a flashlight at the time of the crime. By New Year's Day, the damage had set in. We came yesterday afternoon, and that's the first thing we saw. We saw all the caution tape around it and the fence. And uh, we just started asking questions around. To give you all an overview of what the park usually looks like, this 12 acre recreational area has a splash pad and a walking course, basketball court, and playground. But now the playground structure, surfacing, shade canopy, and women's restroom are all destroyed. It's very disappointing. You know, Henderson is great because it has so many parks. But this one is really special because you have a great view, a great equipment. Equipment that will now have to be replaced over time. And Henderson Police Department estimates that it will cost at least $100,000, if not more, to fix the damage done. And Henderson Police is asking anyone with information to call Crime Stoppers immediately. Reporting live in the newsroom, Madison Kimbrough, 8 News Now.